Hello, Ghostbusters. We got one! I knew there was something strange going on in my collector's room. There's something strange in the neighborhood. Looks like what we have here is a focused, non-terminal repeating phantasm, or what the guys and gals call a class five free roaming vapor. And this looks to be a real nasty one. What you had there was what we refer to as a focused, non-terminal repeating phantasm, or a class five full roaming vapor. Real nasty one too. Time to power up this new Trono wand. Here we go, here we go. All right, we are on, we are on. Systems are go. All right, powering up, powering up. And I think we're ready for action. I ain't afraid of no ghost. I ain't afraid of no ghost. I just wish I had someone here to cross the streams with. There's something very important I forgot to tell you. What? Don't cross the streams. Let's just raise the old ecto goggles here. Let's see, what was that number again? Don't wait another minute. Pick up your phone and call the professionals. Go Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. All right there. Let's give him a call. Pick up the phone and call. Ghostbusters! That was fast. The guys came and helped me kick Slimer's butt. Well, that wasn't such a chore, now, was it? We came, we saw, we kicked its ass. Hey there, everyone. I am that 80s nostalgic toy guy. Welcome back to the collector's table. Welcome back. Guys and gals, I am a huge Ghostbusters fan. And as you can tell by the opening of this video, there's no links that I won't go to show my Ghostbusters fandom. Go New York! So today, on the collector's table, we'll be having one of these awesome, cool, Blitzway 1-6 scale Ghostbusters figures. Blitzway made all four Ghostbusters from the original 1984 Ghostbusters film, plus a lot of other extra accessories props, and weapons. That's right, the proton packs and the neutrona wands. Got your stick. Oh! oh. Heat him up! And they gave a cool, awesome set of extras in the exclusive edition of the Blitzway 4-pack of Ghostbusters. And that is Slimer with a couple extra roadblocks and extras. On the channel, over the coming months, we're going to be going over those awesome characters, those awesome figures, and a spectacular, awesome finale to the 1984 Blitzway whole entire set of collectibles for the 1984 Ghostbusters film. That's going to be some months away, but that thing is huge. Literally, I've got it. Get excited. I'm excited. You're going to want to see that one. Tell you what, I'll take Miss Barrett back to her apartment and check her out. So go ahead and hit that like button if you haven't liked this video yet. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down there in the right-hand corner of your screen. And go ahead and activate notifications. That way you don't miss out on all those future Blitzway Ghostbusters unboxings. This is the collector's table. I'm nostalgic about the Ghostbusters. Let's get Peter Venkman the one six scale Blitzway figure out of this box, go over him, unbox him, and see what Blitzway has done with their one six scale rendition of Pete Venkman. Pete Venkman, congratulations. All right, guys and gals, here's that Blitzway one six scale figure box, the limited edition Pete Venkman with a Venkman patch right across here. Look at that thing. This is a real patch. Blitzway really spares no expense when it comes to packaging and product. And this box right here is a reflection of that. No job is too big, no fee is too big. Down there at the bottom around this box, you will see New York City right there. The New York City skyline. That is pretty cool. Of course, you have the Ghostbusters logo there. The Columbia Pictures logo right here. And right there in the middle, you have that patch that says Venkman. And underneath that, you see Peter Venkman. And then up in the right-hand corner, you will see the Blitzway logo. As you see on the sides, it just has more of that smoky gray and cream colored with some more of the city skyline. And then on the back there, we see a picture of this figure and the likeness of one Mr. Bill Murray, a.k.a. Peter Venkman. Mother puss bucket. Blitzway fans, Ghostbusters fans, Peter Venkman fans, Bill Murray fans, go ahead and leave me some comments. Let's chat about one of our favorite film franchises, 
one of our favorite actors, one of our favorite characters. And if you are a Blitzway fan, one of our favorite figure creators. Blitzway is amazing. I have many Blitzway figures in my collection, and we're going to go over a bunch of them. So do you feel like your addiction is too much to handle right now? Duh. But right now, it's all about Bill Murray, a.k.a. Peter Venkman, and the Ghostbusters. This one six scale figure. Let's get Peter Venkman out of this box. Underneath this box cover is another open face box. We're going to pull this up, give you a first look at Peter Venkman. All right. Ready? And here's that first look right there. So let's go ahead and look again at that open face box here with that Ghostbusters logo down there at the bottom. At the top of the box, we have the Ghostbusters logo. You don't think it's too subtle, Marty. You don't think people are going to drive down and not see the sign. And on that side, we have that awesome Ghostbusters picture logo. On that side, we have a little information we don't care about. Plus, the Ghostbusters logo again. Ghostbusters. Hey, anybody see a ghost? And on the back there, we have that totally awesome, totally nostalgic Ghostbusters through all that smoke and haze of the black, gray, and creams of this box. Mr. Bill Murray, a.k.a. Peter Venkman. Let's get him out of the box. Guys and gals, when I said there were a lot of accessories with this figure, I wasn't lying. There are multiple layers of accessories and a stand. And now there's a better look at Peter Venkman. My favorite Ghostbuster. Hey, let me know while we're talking about favorite Ghostbusters. Who is your favorite Ghostbuster? Leave me some comments. And who is your favorite character overall in 1984's Ghostbusters? It might not be any of the four Ghostbusters. Empty your hands. Don't think of anything. We've only got one shot at this. The choice is made. Whoa, uh, uh. I am a huge Ghostbusters fan, and I have tons and tons of Ghostbusters props, Ghostbusters figures, and Ghostbusters weapons and accessories, and toys and action figures and collectibles. It's all about nostalgia and pop culture and these awesome collectibles. Now, let's go over Peter Venkman, my favorite Ghostbuster. First, we see that totally awesome head sculpt there. That thing is the best head sculpt I have in my collection of Peter Venkman, right there, hands down. That looks exactly like Bill Murray. Hello. I'm Peter. Moving down the suit, you see we have this awesome, film accurate, and actually zippable suit here. This Ghostbusters suit that they wear. It has all the patches and all the logos on it from the front side to the back side. You have the Venkman patch there, just like on the box on his upper left chest. There are the elbow pads on each elbow. And then you have that awesome utility belt that has Peter Venkman's walkie-talkie on there and the ability to hold all of his accessories and his ghost capturing, ghost hunting paraphernalia. This walkie talkie holder can actually come off of his belt. The belt itself is a totally removable belt. If you wanna recreate one of those awesome famous scenes just before they capture Slimer, you can go ahead and do that. This walkie talkie is a complete one six scale replica. You can remove it and you can use it. And there is accessory number one, that awesome walkie-talkie. And as we check out this articulation at the shoulders and at the elbows and here at the wrist, because we have multiple sets of hands, you see that there is a hand that holds. And golly gee, doesn't it just hold this awesome walkie-talkie. Come in, Ray. So right there in his hands, we have that walkie-talkie. We're already recreating one of our favorite scenes from the film. He's looking at me, Ray. It's right here, Ray. It's looking at me. He's an ugly little spud, isn't he? I'm already having so much fun with this figure, and I don't want that fun to stop. So we're going to keep going. We're going to go through the rest of this figure and the rest of the accessories. Let's get Peter Venkman a place to stand. So here's that awesome Ghostbusters logo covered stand. Let's put this thing together and get Peter Venkman something stable to stand on. Before we get this display stand together, go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet. And go ahead and hit that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on any of those future Blitzway unboxings. Mm, your ideas are intriguing to me and I wish to subscribe to your newsletter. This Blitzway stand comes in six different pieces. We put these things together and we'll get Peter Venkman on the display stand. And we have Peter Venkman standing up there on that stand. These figures are really nice. You can use the stand 
or they stand up very well on their own in a display, you can go ahead and have that option. Is this true? Yes, it's true. Peter Vinkman has four ungloved hands there, one with a pointer finger, here's looking at you, kid, and three other hands that are opened. I hate this. Peter Vinkman also has five gloved hands with various hands that hold. Because, of course, as I showed you earlier in the video, you've got to hold that neutrona wand. And then Blitzway went the extra mile. They made a pair of gloves that fold and can go over his belt. Just like that. Hey, anybody see a ghost? In this baggie right here are two cigarettes, one lit and one unlit. You can use those if you want to. I'm going to keep them to the side. And then there was the coup de grace. It is the Proton Pack. Each of us is wearing an unlicensed nuclear accelerator on his back. As you know, at the end of this unboxing and review video, you will find the close-up videos that will show this stuff in more detail. So don't skip that close-up video. That way you can look at the detail a little bit better. So there is that beautiful Proton Pack. Look at all the wires and the components of that thing. Blitzway spared no expense with this thing. They did very well. Really spectacular, spared no expense. On the side that goes up against Peter Vinkman's back, you will see all the buckles, the straps, and the padding that goes up against Vinkman's back when this thing goes on. Then you see that flexible tube that leads from the Proton Pack to this awesomely made Neutrona wand. But all the detail on this Neutrona wand from the handle to the very tip of this thing is absolutely amazing. Believe it or not, there are only two more things to cover before we put this Proton Pack on Peter Venkman, and I bid you adieu. And I bid you adieu. One thing is this awesome firing effect, this plasma stream right here. This thing is absolutely amazing. The detail in that thing is just awesome. It is actually the most detailed plasma stream that I have in my Ghostbusters collection. This thing is really, really cool. You got him. Don't cross the street. Right. Maybe now you'll never slime a guy with a positron glider, huh? The other awesome feature on this Proton Pack is that it lights up. There is an awesome user manual from Blitzway that comes with this thing that will help you find out how to put the batteries in the Proton Pack. Inside the packaging with that instruction manual comes these extra stickers, this Ghostbuster sticker, and some newspaper clippings that are all featured in the film. Just cool extras. Something strange. To gain access to the battery panel, you got to separate these two pieces here, the proton pack itself, from the strap that goes on Peter Bankman's back. And then you can kind of swivel around that way and, and not remove it all the way. Right there is the battery access panel with a screw in there. You unscrew that, and then you can put your battery in there. You've got your battery in there, you snap this back on, and then we're ready to put the Proton Pack on Peter Venkman. And there we go, we have Peter Venkman with his Proton Pack on there. It looks amazing, it looks awesome. Now let's get a hand that holds the Neutrona Wand into his hand, that way we can hold that Neutrona Wand and get to that close-up video. Pop this hand off, pick a gloved hand that holds, pop it on, and fit that Neutrona Wand right there in his hand. There's a lot of small parts and small components on this thing. Just be very careful. That's a collector's tip right there. Be very careful. But that right there is my favorite Ghostbuster, Peter Venkman, from the Blitzway 1-6 scale 1984 Ghostbusters line of figures. I am that 80s nostalgic toy guy. Thank you very much for joining me at the collector's table for another Ghostbusters unboxing. This time, it was the 1-6 scale Blitzway rendition of Peter Venkman played by the one and only Mr. Bill Murray in that 1984 Ghostbusters film. Hit that like button if you would for me. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet. And go ahead and hit that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on the other figures in this line of toys because there's a really cool unboxing at the very end of this toy line. We're going to cross the streams at the end of this one because Peter Vinkman and I have to get out of here. But we'll see you back at the collector's table real soon.
Now that was fun, wasn't it? Now go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the fun on the channel. We'll see you again real soon.